Al, it's great to see you back with the Boston Celtics again. I, I feel like everything has really come full circle for you. Uh, it's my first time getting to talk to you one-on-one, -on -one, but what are your thoughts on rejoining your former team? Uh, man, I'm, I'm really happy. I'm, I'm really excited. I'm really, really grateful for the, for the opportunity. Like you said, it, it has come back full circle and uh, some unfinished business. We got to get that banner 18 and, and, um, and that's the, that's the goal. That's what we're working towards. So I'm, I'm really happy to, to be a part of it. I know your teammates are happy to have you back too. You said during your presser that both JT and Rob Williams reached out to you when the news came out, what were those conversations like? Um, just, just exciting. Um, you know, we, it was, we were texting back and forth, but, um, but you know, the, the excitement was, you know, was there, um, uh, you know, we had, we shared a lot of good moments and, uh, and to be able to now have an opportunity to get it going again. Um, it, it, I really look forward to that. You had said too, during that time that you felt that the change was for the better in needing to leave, but you had learned a lot during your time with the Celtics. Maybe what was your biggest takeaway and where do you think that you grew the most as a player? Um, yeah. So, um, you know, just, um, uh, for me, just getting the perspective of, of everything, um, uh, you know, understanding how, you know, the, the Boston really is a, it's a very special place. Um, and it's, it's a place that me and my family, you know, really enjoy being a part of being a part of the Celtics family. And, and for me, as far as the game, just looking at it, you know, in, in, in a different lens, as far as, um, understanding the progression of the game the game continues to change you know uh the, the style of basketball that's being played now it's it's much different than a few years back and and uh, for me to be in different positions that i wasn't accustomed to um and looking at the game that way um i know that i can have an impact you know with this team and with this group um doing those things yeah, with that impact, there's obviously been some big changes since you left. Uh, the biggest one, Brad Stevens, assuming the role of president of basketball operations. How do you see yourself fitting back into this team? Um, yeah, that's that's definitely different. Um, <laughs> uh, you know, uh, with with, uh, with Brad moving on, and um, uh, I feel like it's gonna be it's gonna be fine. You know, for me, I'm obviously always keeping an open mind, really trying to understand how I can help the group. Um, and help our team and lead them. Um, you know, I, I, I'm really all about winning and, and doing the right things to help us win. So making sure that, you know, defensively we're setting the tone from, from the very beginning, that has to be our focus. Uh, I, I feel like we, we're gonna have the ability to, you know, to score the ball at a, at a pretty high rate with, with some of the great players that we have, but um, defensively setting that tone, I think it's gonna be very important said defensively setting the tone, but also just being able to help lead the team. How are you looking to help the young talent, obviously in the Jays and, and also Rob Williams? Uh, yeah, yeah, just, you know, um, uh, help them in any way that I can um, on the court, um, off the court, making sure that we're doing things the, the right way. And, um, and, I, and I feel like with those guys, they get it, you know, they know what it's about and, 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 you know, they're much different than they were when I left, you know, they're, you know, they're obviously they're more mature, they have more experience. Um, so I'm just here to, you know, to, to help our group um, in, in any way that I can. And, and I know that we have, you know, we have a lot to give uh, as a team. There's, there's a lot more that can be done and, and we're going to be much better. Well, for you as a player, Al, you can play with other bigs or as the lone five. How do you see your versatility, you know, coming in and, and really impacting this group? Yeah, I think, you know, I think it's one of my strengths and um, and, and that's how it's going to have to be. Um, you know, I, I'm sure at times I'll, I'll play some at the four, I'll play most at the five, the different things like that. Um, uh, I think that's a that's always been a strength of mine. And I believe with the with the group that we have you know, I, I'm going to be able to do that. And it's something that, you know, that really excites me. Mm -hmm. We obviously know that there's a lot of work that needs to be done. You even said that during your presser, but with the foundation that you have in place with the young players, what can this Celtics team accomplish this upcoming season and put in the work this off season, like you said, is so important for this group to do? 
Um, yeah, I mean, I, you know, our goals um, with the Celtics, that's one of the things that I, that, that I, that I really um, love about here is just the expectations. You know, there are some high expectations. We understand that. But for us, we're not going to get caught up, um, you know, in the end goal. Like, it's all about really making sure that, that we're working, um, that we're preparing now in the summer to put ourselves in the best position. And once the season gets going, uh, continue to build on that identity. So I, I'm just excited, you know, for that. And uh, and and to and once we get the group together, that's when we're really going to be able to start, you know, taking off. So uh, I'm, I'm excited about it. Oh, and finally, Al, before I let you go, what would you like to say to the Celtics fans out there now that you are back in Boston? Man, Celtics fans, you know, we're going to be ready to go. I'm, I'm very excited. I can't wait to be back in TD Garden. And with, with the whole crowd rocking, getting it together and, and, and ride with us, um, you know, we're going to we're going to play hard. We're going to represent the city the right way. And, um, and and I'm really excited. I can't wait. Well, thank you so much, Al. Looking forward to having you and your family back now with the Celtics family. Thank you.